The prostate gland is about the size of a walnut in most men. It is located in the lower pelvis underneath the bladder and in front of the rectum. The urethra runs through the middle of the prostate and allows us to urinate. Like all cancers, prostate cancer is a disease of uncontrolled cell growth. Treatment options for prostate cancer include radical prostatectomy, hormonal therapy, external beam radiation, and brachytherapy, a form of internal radiation therapy. There are two types of brachytherapy, permanent low-dose radioactive seed implants, also known as LDR, or temporary high-dose radioactive implants, known as HDR. A treatment plan may combine several of these options together to yield the best possible results. Recently, there have been significant advances in the fight against prostate cancer, with improvement in all of the major treatment options. HDR, or high dose rate brachytherapy, provides a series of treatments through catheters placed in the prostate. A radioactive source is temporarily placed inside each catheter using a device known as an afterloader. HDR brachytherapy requires a surgical procedure in which needles are inserted into the prostate gland through the perineum, the skin between the anus and the testicles. Typically, the procedure requires between 15 to 20 needles that are positioned using ultrasound guidance. The tumor can then be carefully treated with a dose of radiation using sophisticated treatment planning software that can adjust the dosimetry to the actual location of the disease. Candidates for HDR brachytherapy include patients with early stage prostate cancer where physicians may use HDR as an alternative to the radical prostatectomy, but with less side effects. For later stage disease, typical candidates for HDR include patients with generally higher PSA and Gleason scores where surgery is not a good option. These are often patients that need aggressive treatment both inside and immediately outside of the prostate. Because HDR treatments are administered through fixed catheters. They can efficiently treat outside the prostate capsule as well. In these cases, HDR is usually combined with external beam radiation to prevent additional spreading outside the prostate.